Hello folks, welcome to my YouTube channel. We're going to try this one more time, folks. Uh, every time I make a video, my husband always winds up calling. And it stopped the video and everything, so now I'm having to redo it again. Which is not a big deal, folks, because I expected him to call. He's at an auction tonight. Um, and like I said, you know, we always try to let each other know uh, what each other's doing. That way we can stay safe that way. But uh, anyway, welcome to my YouTube channel, folks. Uh, we're in here today and we're coloring Alvin the chipmunk. And, um, so anyway, we're going to have fun, you know, coloring him. Uh, today's been a real tiresome day, folks. We got up real early this morning. Uh, we had to take my Pyrenees to get her, um, checked out and get her toenails and stuff trimmed. Because, you know, we usually take our dogs. We got two dogs. And we have to take them in for a, a checkup every six months, you know, to make sure everything's going smooth. Well, we was worried about Saber because she's supposed to get her nails trimmed, you know, like every three months or so. Or, yeah, every three months. Because she has a dew claw. And um, if she doesn't get that trim, folks, it grows into her foot. And it causes her a lot of pain and everything. So we try to, um, you know, fix it where she don't have to go through that suffering and stuff and try to keep up with that. But we got her nails and everything trimmed. So um, what we're going to do next is we usually take her to the salon because she's so big, folks. And she's scared of a hose. And so it's hard for me to groom her because if I get a hose out and try to, you know, take care of her and groom her, um, she takes off running on me and I, I can't groom her, folks. So um, anyway, um, we're going to take her to the dog salon and get her done there. She usually gets that, you know, before winter, before cold weather sets in. Because if you don't bathe your dogs, folks, what'll happen is they'll start uh, getting skin conditions and things like that, you know, from dirt and stuff. So, yeah, you have to give them a bath every so often. Uh, you know, I I mean, we can't give Saber a bath every single day, but uh, we can take her, you know, once in a while and get her done at the salon. Because, you know, Saber doesn't like being bathed, so what she does is after we give her a bath and things like that, she comes home and jumps in the pond. And I think that's uh, probably that she's, upset because she had to go through the ordeal of getting um grooming and stuff but anyway uh we're coloring this alvin and the chipmunk thing and i'll show it to you folks i know you can't see it there because i have to color it with a pencil in case i make a mistake on it folks but anyway um the only problem with this is, folks, is I have these glitter pens that I'm using, and I don't really have brown. So what I'm going to do, um, there's no way of substituting the color with these glitter pens. So what I'll probably do is I'll just... Uh, you know, color his uh, jacket and things like that, folks. And, you know, uh, probably leave the other parts blank because I'm afraid if I color it a different color, it's probably not going to look right. You know, it's probably not going to make him look like the original cartoon character. 
like he's supposed to. I know I look tired, folks, and that's because we got up really early this morning and took her to the vet. And we were over there for an hour. It's almost like taking a, a child to the doctor, folks. You get over there and you have to sit around for an hour or two. We had to take Buddy before we took her. Uh, you know, because he's got that diabetes and he's blind and stuff. So, um, we had to sit over around that vet's office for two or three hours, folks. Because we had so many people ahead of us. So my husband wanted to get over there really, really early today. And it really didn't do much good because we still had to sit there and wait just the same. But I came home and took me a nap, folks. I was tired. <laughs> but um, even though we can't really paint him with what these um, glitter pens, folks. I still showed him to you, you know, and showed you what he looked like and stuff. So that gives you an idea of what he looks like. See, I may one day get on here and, um, you know, and uh, we'll paint him. But I just wanted y'all to see him, and he's got his jacket on with the letter A. And I thought it was pretty cool. And here's another one that I worked on, too, if I can find him. Oh, I actually, to be honest with you, I, I uh, drew Care Bear. I drew him. And let's see, there's another one on here too. You guys remember that little cartoon character named Yosemite Sam? Well, I, I tried my best folks to color him too, or drew him too. And there he is. I thought that Yosemite Sam guy was kind of uh, cute, folks, as a cartoon character. Now, his hat, folks, is like a, I think it's a pearl white looking color or so. Uh, and also his, um, around his eyes here, you know, like his eyebrows and stuff, uh, they're brown. And I think his nose, I'm not sure what his nose is. And his mustache is brown too, and I don't have brown. But um, we can color his tie and things like that, folks. And go from there. But I just wanted to get on here and spend time with y'all, you know. See how y'all are doing, if you're still staying busy with everything. I think my husband's a little bit stronger than I am, folks, because he can, uh, like, go to the bed or something like that early. And he can still uh, go to auction or something like that, and I'm just not that way, folks. Once I've done something like the bed or something like that, I'm ready to come home. You know, you just have a tired day sometimes, folks, you know. 
can't help yourself. We're just uh, slowly working on these folks. It doesn't mean that we have to color them all at the same time, you know. We can save this for another video later. And uh, I can get my paints out. I just didn't get my paints out, folks. But I want to make him look as close to the real thing as possible, folks. I don't want to mess him up by coloring him a different color, you know. I want to make him look like the original cartoon character. Yusuvity Sam is a very hard char character to um, draw, folks, because he's got a lot of detail to him, and it takes some time to draw him. But that's what you want to do. You want to take on challenging things and see how good you do on it. And you know, folks, that going to the vet, that takes up biggest part of your day when you got to sit and wait. Because you come home and you eat you a little something and you're tired from, you know, getting up so early. But I got me a cup of coffee, folks. Here's to you. You know, whenever we do things like this, folks, this gives us an excuse to get in here and spend time together, right? Wait, something don't look right here. There we go. Uh, I don't understand why they don't uh, put a brown pen in these glitter pens, folks. They must not like that color brown. We're going to color his pants. And uh, he's got a belt on too, folks. No, I 
I usually use a light pencil when I draw, folks. That way, if I make a mistake, I can erase it. And it won't look so bad. Uh, I'm trying to figure out what color to paint his pants. Let's see, let me think. I guess we could just color it. Um, we're gonna we're gonna color his pants a, a orange color, folks. You know, because you want to try to add some personality to him, you know. And then I'll have to get out my paints one day and we'll have to work on his, uh, the brown parts where he's got, uh, where he has to be done brown. I just didn't get the paints out today. If you don't draw perfect, folks, don't worry about it, you know? I'm not perfect on my drawing either, but I do the best I can. And it's fun trying, you know. And I also had some rocks over there, too, I wanted to share with y'all that I drew pictures on, too. Uh... We'll do them also. We're just going to take our time, folks, and work on projects and get in here and talk and, you know, uh, spend time together, folks. That's what we're doing. I may have to go get my other pen. Yeah, let me go get it because it's got a pointier uh, thing to it. That's one of them big pens, folks. Oh, I'll be right back. It will leave his hat blank, folks, and his gun and stuff like that. You get the ideal, folks. I'm coloring his boots black, folks, and I'm gonna use this, okay? When I went to the Hobby Lobby, folks, they had all kinds of these uh, magic marker pens. 
I bet they had every color you could think of. You wouldn't have been like, you know, I'm wanting brown right now. You wouldn't have had to worry about it with those uh, magic markers. And you know what's weird, folks? They didn't have um, glitter pens in there. And that's a Hobby Lobby. But I tell you, those people has about anything you need in the way of being creative. Well, thank you for joining my YouTube channel, folks. You're awesome, and you got this. You have a blessed day, folks. Bye-bye.